Hello everyone! Welcome back to Root Time channel. Last week we talked about the main causes of cystic and nodular acne and possible treatment options. If you have not seen the video, be sure to click it right here. In today's video, we wanted to share with you the key ingredients and products that are great for acne treatment and prevention. Please note that none of these products will replace you as cystic or nodular acne treatments prescribed by your doctor. The ingredients are here to help you along the way, especially focusing on prevention. But make sure to remember that consistency is a key. And of course, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the Root Time channel, and hit the bell so you can be notified whenever we upload. And now we are going to talk about the key ingredients that will help you treat your nodular and cystic acne. In general, the top products used for this purpose are fortified with ingredients that are specifically made to unclog pores. Their role is to get deep beneath the surface and inside the pores to go and treat the acne-causing impurities that are actually causing your cystic or nodular breakouts. In acne care, there are four here ingredients that are recognized as a great ways to keep them under control. There are salicylic acid, benzoyl peroxide, sulfur, and retinol. Now, let's look at each of these ingredients separately. The first ingredient is salicylic acid or beta-hydroxy acid, which is a very popular chemical exfoliant recommended by many, many dermatologists. It penetrates deep into the pores by binding in excess oil and reducing its production. Salicylic acid also reduces inflammation and prevents the future pimples from forming. There are a few products with salicylic acid as an active ingredient that we recommend. The first one is PCA Skin Acne Gel. This facial spot treatment is recommended for occasional breakouts. It contains 2% of salicylic acid and AHA that help to exfoliate and reduce the blemishes. Free of synthetic dyes and fragrances, the gel comes in about 29 milliliters a bottle. A little goes a long way. The second product is Dolbagin Medical Cleansoderm MD Pore Therapy Toner. This medicator formula promotes clear pores by controlling the excess oil with 2% of salicylic acid. This toner also contains glycerin that helps to reduce inflammation and irritation. The second hero ingredient is benzoyl peroxide. It is very well known for treating dead skin cells and getting rid of bacteria. Mostly effective for mild to moderate acne, it is great to clean the skin that is already treated and prevent new acne from forming on that treated skin. The following product is a great treatment to help with scarring, but it is also possible to use it for mild to moderate active acne. The La Roche-Posay Effaclar Dual Dual Acne Treatment is actually the only treatment with micronized benzoyl peroxide. It also contains light hydroxy acid, a microexfoliant that is perfect to provide cell-by-cell -cell exfoliation. Non-drying and oil-free, it is usually recommended for post-acne treatment. It is also fragrance-free, which makes it very suitable for all skin types. Now moving on to the next very famous ingredients, retinoids. They are great ingredients to clear breakouts at the very starting point and faint acne scars by accelerating the collagen production. The differing adapalene gel 0.1 acne treatment is a popular topical gel. It helps normalize the skin turnover and tart inflammation and clogged pores. The great characteristics of this product that it contains adapalene, which is an anti-inflammatory agent that makes the product suitable for the sensitive skin. This product is oil-free, alcohol-free, and fragrance-free. Also, it doesn't clog pores. The fourth and last hero ingredient is sulfur. It is usually milder than the three first that we mentioned, but it's still quite strong and it works to exfoliate the dead skin and get rid of impurities. The Peter Thomas Roth Therapeutic Sulfur Acne Mask is a medicated mask with 10% maximum strength over the counter sulfur. It also has purifying kaolin clay and also bentonite clay. You can use this mask to clear up blemishes and prevent their return, and it also contains aloe vera to soothe and calm the irritated skin. However, we recommend you to use caution when using this mask as it contains perfume. We would usually recommend it to use it as a preventative acne treatment. So we have just listed a few products that are well recognized at helping with acne at the same time with your prescribed treatments. But there are a few honorable mentions that we would like to make. So the first product is Cetaphil Pro Oil Removing Foam Wash. This product is great at removing impurities and makeup. It also contains licorice root extract and zinc to calm the irritation. It is also fragrance-free and will not clog your pores. 
The second product is the Sovereign Silver First Aid Gel. This gel leans a little bit more towards medication rather than skincare, but we still thought it would be a great idea to mention it. It actually has a great track record when it comes to reducing inflammation, calming lesions in the skin, and allowing the wounds to heal quicker. And judging from the reviews, it can be of great help for the most painful pimples. And finally, we wanted to mention the subscription option. If you've watched us before, you know that we have made a video that we will link right here about Curology, a subscription service that is specifically related to acne. Depending on your acne and how severe it is, you can get an adapted routine that will help you with your treatment. So we think it's worth looking into. And now let's move on to something easier to digest. Things that we usually do in our everyday life without necessarily noticing it. Exactly. We will talk about the simple do's and don'ts that might help you on your acne journey. A quick and friendly reminder. Because cystic and nodule acne can be quite severe, please do not forget to... Number one, wash your face twice a day. And if you work out during the day, another simple wash with a gentle cleanser might be recommended. Number two, make sure to remember your makeup before going to sleep to avoid bacteria build up. Number three, use a lightweight moisturizer after you cleanse your face. Number four, if you're using any active ingredients, make sure to use them during nighttime. Number five, avoid touching your face and picking up the acne. And if you're going to apply cosmetics, make sure to thoroughly wash your hands. Number six, in case of any acne conditions, make sure to avoid hair to skin contact. And don't forget to wash your pillowcases frequently. Number seven, if you're using any of the type of products such as makeup, shampoo and conditioner, make sure to avoid any contact with active pimples. Okay, we hope this video was helpful. If you have any products that you would like to add, please don't forget to mention in the comment section below. Also, don't forget those everyday tips that we have just shared. What is most important is to be patient and kind to your skin. And if this video was helpful to you, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up to support our channel. Please subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell to receive notifications whenever we upload. We'll see you next week. Bye! Bye.